Bye. Hello guys, today in this video I'm going to be showing you guys the easiest method to fully optimize your windows. This works for Windows 11 and Windows 10. And this uh, method just like, um, it just shows you easy ways on how to boost FPS, lower input delay, de-bloat your windows, lower ping and everything. There's, there's a complete windows optimization guide and it's very simple. There's nothing too advanced or nothing too hard. It's just very simple. As long as you listen to what I say, nothing will go wrong. And I'll link this pack in my discord, which, um, I will also link in my description. So go join that to be able to get a pack. And once you extract the zip file, it will look like this. And once you do it, uh, once you extract it, you just first want to come on the first um, file and you want to read this. This basically just says, if you don't create a restore point, something goes wrong. Um, I'm not held responsible and I won't be able to help in how to fix it. So make sure to create a restore point. And how you do that is you just go on this create restore point thingy. You go on configure. You want to put this on 5%. And you want to make sure turn of system protection is on for the drive that you have windows on and then next you want to create and um, press create and you want to name it before optimization and you just want to press create this could take a while to um complete but just wait and then mine finished quite quickly and then once you do that you want to check for windows updates if you have any you want to install them and then restart your pc and then come back and since uh, yeah i don't have any so yeah next you just want to uninstall any apps you don't need um i really did on that so I won't, I won't get into it again but it's just very simple next startup apps you just want to so you want to come here if you have something that you don't want starting up as soon as your pc turns on you can just pr like press on it you can have press disable here or you can right click on it and press disable and then you just want to go through all the apps that was listed there next is basically the same thing but more in depth and you want to come here you want to go and log on and uncheck everything you don't want starting up on your pc first turns on so i've already done that so there's nothing here for me and yeah next you just want to disable uac if you guys want to re-enable it after you guys can just come on um yeah you can just tap in and then you want to put this to max or usually I would say leave it here but yeah next there's where you start the tweaking first it's just going to be de bloating your windows and yeah so how you, um, how you do that is you just run this with um, exe over here and then this just make sure it runs it with admin permissions if you guys want to see a list of what it deletes you can just open this and then it shows you where it deletes and then yeah so it will look like this you just want to tap in number one and then we'll show like these blue things the, this just means that it's deleting it um i mean not deleting de bloating your windows basically the same thing but yeah and once it's finished i'll show you guys what it will look like um this could take a while depending on your pc this just depends on your specs and how fast the pc is but yeah And now, once it's finished, it will say deep bloating is done. You can exit by pressing any key. So you just press any button and it's finished. That's it for the deep bloating. Next, you want to come back and check for driver updates. How you do this is um, you want to double click on this SDI. Um, just stands for Snappy Driver Installer. You want to allow access. You want to come here. And then you want to press this PC only. Accept. OK. And then you want to press Select All. You can uncheck the uh, restore point since we already did that. And you want to press install this could take a while even if it's only like 20 megabytes it could take a while um so i'm not gonna do that here um so i'll just close out of this and then next is the windows optimization this is what does like the main tweaks so you just want to run this exe over here and then it'll show you this nice um G gui and you can just run the tweaks depending on what you want. I would say do all of them. Um, I won't do it now because it will most definitely crash my recording. That's why I won't get into it right now. But yeah. And just letting you guys know, all of these um, um, tweakers are all made by me. If if there's any tweaks that aren't um, made by me, I would give credits. 
and I think there might be like one or two but yeah next is just a ping tweaker and then this just does ping tweaks I want it right now since it'll disconnect my Wi-Fi for like a few seconds which will also crash my recording next is network adapter settings this is very simple you just want to go on your device manager and then let it go you want to drag it here you want to go on network and then you want to choose your one my one is this next you want to go on power management you want to uncheck these two options next you want to go on advanced and just copy the settings that are here if there are settings that um, let's say alp offload and that's not here do not change it only change the ones that are here so um, yeah that's also very straightforward and next is dns jump pod this automatically finds you the best dns server so you want to go on um fastest dns um usually you guys would have more like options to, uh, that you would run through but i only have a few right now don't know why but yeah next you press flash dns and then that should be finished next you want to go on lower input delay this um like it changes your polling rates to 1000 hertz on your key, um any usb device that's connected to your pc so for, uh, you want to go on it should automatically bring it to mice and you want to press on it you want to press on um all the stuff that pops up here install service and then you want to check filter on device if they if this brings like an error or says um yes or no then don't press yes choose no otherwise it will um stop your mouse from working only do this option you, you can press it first but if it says an error after this just press no and yeah next you just want to put the hertz to a thousand and then that's basically it you want to do that for keyboards too you want to do the same thing install service for the device and then a thousand and then that's basically it for the polling rates next is just some keyboard and mouse um red trials you guys can take a look at it if you want it just changes your keyboard and mouse data key size which lowers input delay and next is drive tweaks um this tweaks your ssd and hdd so you want to press number one and then it'll t um, tell you what drive do you have you can tap in ssd for ssd wait what i'll fix that issue but before i upload the video but yeah let me see if hdd works okay yeah i'll fix this issue before i upload the um video but you, what you want to do is press number one and over here you want to tap in ssd or hdd depending on what your windows is installed on but yeah next is ram optimizations and then this you just want to press number one and then tap in how much ram you have so i have 16 gigabytes so i'll type in 16 and then it will say ram tweaks have been successfully applied then you just want to press any button and it'll bring you back out next is gpu tweaks you first you just want to run it you want to run this and it tells you which um gpu you have if you have an nvidia gpu you want to tap in number one if you have a um what do you call it amd gpu on the tab number two i want that now because um it could possibly take away like um what do you call it my uh, graphics was um second which will crash my recording so yeah next you want to come in your gpu option here next you want to see this optimized profile you want to drag it over and with your profile inspector and that tweaks your nvidia control panel next is intel you just want to copy these settings and then next is amd um for these amd tweaks um i got them from adam x and you guys can go sub to him if you want next is programs these are just some programs that are very useful first is filter keys um so how you want to use this is you want to tick the first two so on and available next save to registry you want to put this first one to zero second one to 200 and the third one to 40 and then I've, I've seen some people use 150 and then 25 but if you do like your mouse and keyboard um say you click once it could like register as like three or four clicks that's why i would recommend these settings which are good for typing too next is memory duct i already have it open here so i won't download it again but basically how once you install it it will look like this this just cleans out all uh, memory cache and stuff and um you want to optimize the settings first so you want to like, copy these settings here 
next you want to go on file settings and you want to go on memory cleaning and use the settings i have the only ones you'll need to change is these three i'm pretty sure and then copy these numbers here too and then yeah next you're going to press clean memory and then that's basically it next is msi afterburner if you have a gp with fans you, you want to download this and then um, once you install it it would look like this and this is very simple you can like um overclock your gpu and stuff and the fan speed i won't get into it too much in this video if you want there's more in-depth guides you can search on youtube um but yeah next is quick cpu i actually deleted this so i'll just quickly re-download it to show you guys what it's like and then i'm gonna launch it here and then it could take a while for it to load, so just give it a second. And then once it's fully loaded, you just want to put all of these settings here to 100% and then apply and then close. And then next, you just want to come back in the pack and then this is just like a cleaner. So um, it just cleans out all temp files, prefetch files and stuff. You just want to run it. And then once it closes, it means it's finished. So yeah, that's basically it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave um, a like and subscribe. And bye. Yeah, I got what grand in my dummy up. Who caught a mill in my go yard dump? I win the guess, so you still got a show. Born with the drip and just done how to hustle. Look at your bitch through these DR by folks. I get me some hands, she been that shit over.